Rules and Ethics Board is um, an official part of Student Council that deals with making sure that all of Student Council follows the Constitution and the bylaws. This Rules and Ethics Board must be elected by October 1st, this Thursday. This is a problem because there are requirements for appointment that can't be accomplished by then. So the Rules and Ethics Board would is by the bylaws has to go through things such as a new member orientation, take an online quiz, stuff that we didn't intend and no one really saw coming about what exactly you would need to do. Lack of appointing the board will lead to closure. According to the bylaws, the student council is going to be in closure. And what that essentially means is that uh, it, can't it cannot function officially. At the uh, previous administration sort of I think out of real disrespect for the bylaws, didn't appoint. I think it's, what's important to me is to make sure that we are actually following the bylaws. So last year, student council should have actually been in closure for the entire year, uh, but there was some real flagrant disregard for the bylaws. I would much rather do things properly. I mean, I think it's a much greater concern not to go into closure and to disobey the bylaws. And so it could take, you know, at the quickest a week, or it could take two weeks. Hopefully the sooner the better, I always say. However, even if it takes that long, Axler thinks it's worth it. The moment to understand that the bylaws of agency organizations are often a little bit outdated and have relics, but that it's very important to, to respect them and work always looking towards the future to ensure that they are reflective of the needs of current students.